1965 Race Relations Act by Alina Azadeh. The sculpture that I created, from which this image is taken, um, is, is a play on the Acts Room here, which contains all the Acts of Parliament, which used to be um, uh, written on calfskin and rolled up and stored. And, and it's still, I learnt, it's still um, now printed on calfskin and um, on vellum. And so I, it's a play on that because I basically uh, took, um, created, recreated this image that I, I was very inspired by see, seeing that room. And I've taken cloths and fabrics from countries around the world and from the UK, countries that are connected to the UK by immigration or colonialism. And I've kind of coloured the scrolls, so I've, 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 I've covered them in, the, in, in, in these fabrics. And then on the inside of each scroll is a kind of an extract, either from the, some of the Race Relations Act texts or from people along the way who were connected to the, you know, the institution of the first legislation. So people involved in the Bristol bus boycott, Tony Benn, the cultural theorist Stuart Hall, Doreen Lawrence. So it's really the idea that of something around the collective and the individual. There's a structure and an order in the idea of legislation. But in order for that to work, you know, that people with their own individual identities, group identities, you know, living together and bumping up against each other, and that's a kind of complex, messy, but very enriching process. And, and in, in, in a way, these banners, for me, are a chance to kind of acknowledge those people and our very, very varied, diverse sources in a single image. <laughs>